welcome back and we are going to make dosa with a twist today welcome my beautiful family and i am amazed at the results how many people are liking and appreciating my videos of any sort sweet songs or whatever i am posting so in dosa with a twist we are going to take one bowl or one cup of easy to make kind of thing is one cup of rice flour and 3 to 1 ratio so we are going to take one third of like whatever one cup rice flour so you will take one third cup of urad dal atta urad flour and what i'm going to do is instead of uh, putting it in water i'm going to make it in curd water add salt to taste and just leave it overnight is the plan and i keep you posted what happens next till then you can think about liking sharing checking my other videos ek cup pani dal ke maine isko mix kar liya hai acche se aur raat bhar ko Leave it for overnight. One cup of rice flour and one um one third cup of the lentil flour, urad dal lentil flour with salt, pepper, and yogurt. Two spoons yogurt, salt to taste, and pepper. I'm going to soak it or leave it overnight just to get the fermentation done. keeping it for the overnight thing i am going to put now some things to make it a twist in dosa so first things is curry leaves you can take more curry leaves but i like to put curry leaves just for the fragrance and for the health thing these are really good for your health so cut them like small and then i'm going to put the cumin seeds and some um spring onions from my garden herbs This gives a nice flavor to the dosa, the traditional basic dosa. You can make with the batter that you have got ready, but I want some kind of flavor extra added to it. So you can add whatever your body is craving for. Mine was craving for this, and then to make it crispier, you can add some more oil, which is my blend oil, mix oil. You can check that um, video from above, and I'm going to put half a spoon of that. You can add more depending on how your health issues are. And now, once again, please check the sensitivity to any of the ingredients here before trying. So, if you have some sensitivity, skip, avoid, don't use that. And now, I'm going to put some cilantro, coriander leaves, for another flavor. This is one of my favorite one. People do not use the sticks, thinking that these are too thick. But while cooking, they just go soft. So, cut them small, little baby ones, like thin ones, if you want. but if you can have it bigger you can cut according to your needs next what i'm going to do is just to make the batter a little thinner so that i can make crispier and not thicker dosas you can call it dosa or dosa with a twist this is majorly a south indian dish and watch it till the end for different kind of hacks surprises secrets to make it better make it thin now by adding some water You can also add some more curd, yogurt if you want. If you like it. So once again, let me remind you. I have rice flour and urad dal flour, the lentils. So this is like carbs, proteins, some fiber, and a ready-to-go kind of a batter. Easy one. You can have it as snacks. I'll be making. Uh, you can use that dosa chutney with twist, and I'll be making two more chutneys and adding those videos today. So just make it like really thin to make it easy to make. And now we are going to make the dosas. I'm going to start with small dosas. If you do not do, if you want to go for healthy and no oil, this is a non-stick pan that you take, and you make it on that one. You may or may not put the oil. I like it oil because I don't like the dry dosa. Part. So you can also do it like this. I show you different kind of dosa making. 
you can make it like a rava sort of dosa and just make it like this pancake is what you are looking for different sorts of pancakes can be made you can put some cheese on it you can do it whatever creativity whatever experiments you want to try on that because it has the um, uh, onion sorry rice flour and uh, urad dal flour it needs for me it needs oil a little more you can use desi ghee you can use coconut oil depending on your needs and your choices and then let it cook i try to turn it but some people just cover it up like this and let it cook in its own heat get it out from the sides first and then the total some people like it to eat it this way with a half cooked top i like it to make it crispier and nicely cooked so i turn it up maybe the first one might stick to the pan so that the pan and uh, the dosa are like more uh, compatible i would say and pan gets set you can use an iron pan i might do that later in my next video because iron is really good it gives iron to the body and which is what is needed basic iron supplements instead of supplements you can use the iron pan for cooking and then do it and otherwise you can make it like this And now comes the plating. If you haven't liked or subscribed my other videos and all, check out the chutney to go with this or idli chutney. Both are fine. And then goes the dosa. Like, subscribe, give it a thumbs up, or subscribe. It tastes yummy. See you in my next video.